Hey, I'm Kai, and I live in this house truck out in the woods. About 10 million exterior tour videos, but this video is for anyone who's new or maybe started following me right around the barter talk situation. So I normally make videos about living in a house truck, building a house truck, and living off-grid out in the country. I've been living in this 1992 international truck for the last five years now, and I've owned it since 2013. I've spent the last decade building this thing up from what was just a cab chassis to what is now a really lovely little wooden cabin on wheels. At the time that I bought the truck, the tiny house movement wasn't even really a thing yet, so I never even considered building a house on a trailer. But to be honest, I think now I actually prefer it. I have a couple of friends who live in tiny houses, and trying to tow a 30-foot long trailer is quite a thing. Whereas with this, it's attached to the truck, it makes it way easier to drive. The truck itself is a diesel engine, six speed, a stick shift, it's got hydraulic brakes, it's really easy to drive. If you can drive a big old pickup truck, you'd be able to drive something like this, no problem. The whole house is made out of two inch square tube steel that's been welded, and then it's had wood attached on the outside, so the whole structure is very lightweight and very, very rigid. A lot of people ask, isn't it quite heavy with all that wood? But all of this is mostly um, Douglas fir and Western red cedar, which are both very lightweight softwood species that are known for their rot resistance. So the shingles are untreated. They don't need any kind of stain or anything like that. They're getting a little bit discolored down here just from the rain, but they, they won't rot for about 30 years or so. Something that people have made quite a lot of fuss about is the fact that I have an outside shower I am working on the inside shower, hopefully it'll be finished by this winter, but I've actually showered outside for the past five years, and this is in the Canadian wilderness, so the snow got, comes up to about here, and I shovel a little pathway and then shovel a little hole in the snow so I can shower. Like this. So if anyone has any questions about mobile living, building house trucks, or anything along those lines, please shoot me a question. I'd be more than happy to answer. Right, OP? Yeah. <laughs>